Hey there, welcome back to AI Code King. It was great while it lasted, but my free trial for GitHub Copilot expired yesterday. And obviously, I am too cheap to pay for their services, which apparently would save me thousands of hours of manual labor. However, I am also even lazier now due to their free trial. So I need something to use that could do what GitHub Copilot did, but for free. And I thought I wouldn't find anything free, which would ultimately lead me to quit programming and take refuge in a secret bunker. But, unfortunately, that didn't happen. I found out about two free alternatives to Copilot that would make me lazy again. The first one was Kodium, and the second one was TabbyML. Kodium was free and used its own model, which is good but it wouldn't be as good as a custom model that I can fully customize. So, I chose Tabby ML. You can configure it with any custom model, and it has extensions for most IDEs. Pretty cool. When you start Tabby ML, you have the option to put in the model you want and get it started with that model. Now, let's try to get it installed and check it out. To install it, go to their site. Here you'll find all types of installation guides. I'll be using the Docker one. You have two options here, one for GPU-based computing and one for CPU-based computing. I'll use CPU-based computing. Let's run it. Okay, it's installed now. Now, we'll need to install the VS Code extension. As you can see, I have got it installed here. Also, to check if it is working fine, you can look at the bottom of your VS Code, and you'll see a tick mark beside Tabby. Now, let's try to write some code with it. First, let's try basic HTML. Let's create a form here. Okay, it's suggesting some basic boilerplate code for a form. To incorporate its changes, we'll need to click Tab, and it will get added. Now, let's try some Python code. Let's try to write a function to print a message. Okay, it suggests the code. Pretty good. I think this is amazing. You can use it with open source models, plus you don't need to always have an internet connection as it's all local. Pretty cool. I like it a lot. I think this tutorial will be short-lived, because ultimately we'll be taken over by AI, and AI will make us their assistants. Pretty cool. Anyway, if you liked this video, Give it a thumbs up, share, and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in the next video. Till then, bye.